Hello everybody, my name is Shretex and welcome back to Star Sector and my carry only let's play. I have dashed across the universe to get back to June, moments before the Ludic Church expedition actually tries to steal all my AI cores, which I'm not a fan of because they're mine. Now, for some reason, they stopped on the way, which is very lucky because I wouldn't have made it in time otherwise, to steal the independence com relay in the system. I don't know why. Regardless, I can now attack them. Also, you may have just saw in the little menu here, we're also going to get attacked by the hegemony in 14 days as well. So I don't know what I've done to annoy everybody, apart from using AI calls which are banned, but they want my stuff, and I will not let them. Now, let's take these guys down. Out of uh, all the fleets you can probably see here, this one's pretty weak. Who are you? Oh yeah, I got severe issues with pirates at this point. <laughs> I need to invest in some kind of security, um, like patrol HQ or something. Okay, so considering this is a holy fleet, the blessed mission, it looks like they're using pirate ships, which I think is quite funny. <laughs> Apart from a few little hounds and stuff. Let's have a talk to them, shall we? What do they want to say? Submit, repent, and your sinful technologies will be smashed. Resist, and only God's holy vacuum will show you mercy. Well, they're clearly cultists. Let's take them down. If I want to get my AI, I will use my AI. You cannot take Jack G uh, what was it Chat GPT from me. Sign of that. I'm not, I'm not completely clear up in the times, okay? Um, it was a pretty small fleet, right? I reckon my yeah, let's just do like two Tempests and my carriers, and we should be okay. I'm not really done much between episodes. I literally uh, returned. I did sell a lot of goods, by the way. I sold like 16 AI core, the the really basic ones. Don't worry, to get a bunch of money. And that's pretty much it, really. <laughs> that's all I've done. Okay, let's try to get these guys out of the way. Engage! I was going to see, where's... Ah, that, there he is. You probably should kill that guy pretty quickly. Oh, wow, these guys are getting wrecked. I shouldn't be surprised. I mean, I have a lot of carriers. <laughs> yeah, maybe deploying uh, the Tempest as well is a bit of an overkill, but they didn't cost that much anyway. Yeah, I'll focus on this guy first. Yes, we're by how much of a power difference it is just be adding in additional longbow uh, bombers. It made a huge difference. Oh, this isn't great. This guy is going to wreck my... Help me, brother! He's not overloading. The AI seems to have gotten a lot better at not overloading all the time. I say it, they got overloaded then, but still, they're a lot better than they used to be. Okay, wait, what happened to... Why are you so damaged, Tempest? You're fighting like a... I don't understand... <laughs> what happened over there? Normally they're pretty tanky. I think, is this the last guy left already? No, there's a few left. Um, I don't think they have much chance, to be honest. I like how my Tempest has completely flanked them. Oh, that was not very good defense. Let's try again, shall we? I might need to get my guys to come back to base until I get more um, units repaired. Wait for me, enemy. I could probably kill them with my... Um... Oh, he's getting away. Okay, unless I get my guys repaired very quickly, I don't think I'm going to be able to stop this guy from escaping. So I think I need at least, well, probably the full wing of torpedo bombers. Screw it, it'll be fine. Men, it's time. Engage. I'll do the damage boost as well. Okay, hopefully these overload. No, you got away. Ah, oh, damn it. Well, I tried. <laughs> the other two guys should probably die in a second. Let's just watch the uh, end of the battle here. I love how I can just, like, change my display and watch somewhere else. I think it's pretty awesome. Oh, no. Oh, no. Right up the ass. That guy's out of it. Oh, actually, i got to kill this guy. I can probably help. I can help here. He thought he could escape, but literally, you know, there was an entire carrier above him. To be fair, I was going to say, to be fair, he might activate the damage reduction. Although, it didn't work that well. Wow, that was a lot of damage. He might still escape. Let's hope we can do it. It's so close. Come on. Excellent. So, I probably have to chase this entire fleet down. Because my colony has literally zero defenses. These must be all the marines inside. The holy, the crusaders. I will show them a crusade. Oh, I didn't kill them all. <laughs> Damn it. Um, okay, that's not great. If you're wondering why I have loads of drugs, I will explain in a second. I promise. Uh, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Negative five relations, then don't attack me. 
Do the church. It's not hard. Oh my god, there's the vibe! How is this man escaping me? <laughs> I can't risk it. As I have no defenses, I think a single ship can probably overwhelm my defenses. We have to kill it. Okay, we got it. Lunar Church has been firmly spanked. Also, I'm going to nick this. I don't know how this is going to work. I'm not going to lie. So, I already have a plus two in the system, right? Over here. Do I now have a plus three in total? Have I gamed the system? I, I don't know. <laughs> Hopefully I have. We'll have to see in a second. I like how Lunar Church is sending a relief fleet as well as attacking me at the same time. It's like a, they're like a bipolar nation. They're very confusing to be with. So while I was in the prison freeport, I got offered a mission from a, a guy in a very dark and danky bar to offer 1,400 uh, drugs to my very own colony. I don't know why, <laughs> but I guess because people want the drugs. But um, still, if I look at accepted, I'm going to get a quarter of a million pounds from this. from going to my own system. <laughs> I was like, oh, take it. Perfect. So I'll do that immediately. And also, I guess it will help my own colony as well. Excellent. Trade, important medium. I'm going to develop that contact, I think. I've not actually been back here in ages, guys. We've not been in uh, June for a long time. Let me just, uh, before I forget, let me just, uh, where is it? Develop contact. Trade missions seem busted, everybody. You can make money really quickly. Um, what does this do? Whenever cultivating a relationship with the contract is a priority for you, priority contracts will have more missions available. And the missions will be of a higher quality. Because she is actually set up in the prison freeport with a gate. I can teleport there, teleport around the map. I could probably make money in no time if I really wanted to. Uh, anyway, priority target for sure. What does this do? Importance of the person is whatever hierarchy or social structure they belong to. A more high place or connected individual will have more difficult and more profitable missions and opportunities to offer. Very cool. I like that system. Okay, uh, while I'm here, I need to pick up a ton of stuff. So first off, we definitely have the massive amount of drugs there. Perfect. Um, let's get all this stuff. So I actually colonized a cult planet last episode, or was it the episode before? At some point, we'll take this guy. We can make it w uh, warmer. I don't know where to use this shit, but I will probably find it one day. And I guess I can nick this and install it somewhere. I don't know. Do you know what? I might actually just, um, I'll keep this one and these two in storage. Yeah, I'll leave the rest alone. I guess, apparently, you get a lot of volatiles from mining and gas giants. So I might see if I can find one to just install stuff in at some point. Uh, okay, apart from that, I actually have a lot of money right now. <laughs> um, we need to probably expand things out. Now, I'm not actually sure what I want to build, to be honest. Um, normally, we want to try and get live market shares and stuff. We've already got a 17% market share. Loads of drug production. Um, is there anything that I can maybe duck into? I don't think I need farming. If I were cool, oh, it's not on here. My colony winter, I think, had a pretty good farming setup. So I think I'll farm over there. Unless it was Oasis, maybe. Um, adequate farming. No, probably not the place I want to be. I do a scattered ruins, though. Okay, I'll tell you what. First off, I think I can actually... As a pay free port. Stability 10? Damn, this used to be at risk of being a uh, rebellion, by the way, at some point. So I'm pretty impressed that they've done that. Okay, what I'm going to do then, I'm going to set up people here. Increase the growth rate. When this is over, so it's going to take a few months, we will then build a heavy industry. Which is going to cost a lot of money, but it'll be fine. Uh, and then... Oh, we need two, don't we? I forgot. Okay, so we actually need to get not only heavy industry, but also patrol HQ. I think after the first level, it then requires you to use an industry point to get it bigger. But I really want my uh, fleet HQ to be in the middle of the core system so I can project ships out from that like central location. Uh, so I will build this in the interim, which will increase the stability and stuff, so pretty handy. And I guess we just have to wait a little bit to get the rest of the stuff sorted out. The growth rate is cursed because of the um, tribute I'm paying. Though at this point, well, as soon as I get to the point where I no longer have to worry about... Well, I got my own fleet. I can probably break that contract and just kill whoever tries to attack me. If I actually look at the overall... Let's have a look. Story. Scoreboard. 
If you look at this, only the hegemony, I can't say that word, it's such a weird word, everybody, and the Persian League and Lut Church actually have capacity to fight. So in theory, the Sindarian Didat actually can't fight me. Wait, actually, if I'm saying this, why am I bowing down to them? Because I think what happened at some point, they must have lost nearly all their territory. They have a military world, though. Curious. Let's go over there and have a look at the military world. Let me just kill this guy as well, don't mind me. Or oh, this might be a super easy battle. Let's just take it down with some uh, Tempest, and I'll also go with myself. Yeah, because uh, I think I might just take their stuff. <laughs> if they've only got that defending them, I wonder if I can uh, declare war on the Sindarians, knock them down a size, and take their awesome level 7 planet, and go from there. It could be possible. Okay, let's take these guys down first. Oh no, I feel so bad. Keep bombing, men. Beautiful. Yeah, I'm actually sure how big the fleet's getting base game, actually. I normally play with uh, a variety of mods, like, for instance, increasing the size of the... Guys, there's a giant Polk in your ways. Don't shoot at it. Oh, come on, people. Wait, have they... Oh, he's, got... he's been overloaded. How long would an overload last on a bomber? Apparently a long time. Oh, he's like. Actually, I think overload sometimes is dictated. I think it's a base value, and then it's also based off how much flux you went over. So if I was only over like 10 flux, it wouldn't be that bad. But if I was over by like 50% of my um, flux capacity, it would be a disaster. Okay, the rest of them escaped, so I'm pretty well. Can you guys hunt those people down for me? No, why do you guys suck at capturing civilian vessels? You're Tempest. <laughs> You're like the fastest frigate in the game. I have no idea. But I've leveled up though. Okay, let's grab... I really did want to get... A lot of things, to be honest. I, I'm a very greedy man. I want all the skills. But no, no, no. We're going to go for this one. I'll make it an elite skill. And now it means I can leave on the attack command thing for my fighters while also moving at maximum speed, which is super handy. Okay, cool. Now... Let's go back to what I was doing, shall we? Before I leave, though, let me just double check. Is there any awesome missions I might be able to pick up? I can buy a mule. I decline. No, thank you, sir. Okay, let's get out of here. Oh, wait, I was going to double check. Sorry, I forgot. Uh, June. Comms read A2. So this is not stacking. Bit of a shame, but I understand. <laughs> it would have been a bit broken otherwise. I'm not going to lie. Wait. I just remembered something. Estimated arrival time, nine days. We're about to get attacked in this system as well. I will hide, and we will kill the invading fleet, and then we can do what I want to do. It's only been like two seconds, by the way, but then this giant pirate fleet appeared out of nowhere, so I guess I have to kill that one as well. Um, I'm pretty sure pirate activity is not brilliant at the moment. Um, I actually got a warning. There are rumors that a pirate raid targeting your colonies may be organized at some point in the future. This outcome will be averted if the progress event goes below 50. So I probably need to kill this one. Actually, I think if it's a big fleet, we might be okay. Uh, also, it's worth mentioning, my agent actually successfully destroyed the looted path cell. So I'm very proud of them. Um, I gave them a medal and everything. Should be a fun battle, I think. This actually looks like a big boy. Okay, let's take him down. We're going to deploy my own big boy. Oh, it's so sad. That's like the cap of the uh, fleet size there. Let's go for it. Like I said, in this series at least, I'm not going to change the limits. But when we play again, I, I will. <laughs> we'll have the big old super battles again. They will be back. Okay, can you guys grab the sense jammer? And I guess the com relay? Why not? Isn't the same thing. The calm before the storm. Okay. So I guess we want to probably prioritize down the enemy attack cruisers in case they uh, gank one of my beautiful carriers. I like how we got sense of jammer. That's probably the one I'm happy with the most. It's annoying they got a nav boy though. Oh! There's a random hound over there. I doubt we'll be able to survive multiple. Okay, there they go. It's time! We're all going it this way. Including me. Now, I just want to double check something. So right now I got the speed boost, right? It didn't work? Oh, I must have misread how that thing works. Okay, well, 
in the past, if you got the Helmsman skill, you used to be able to use carrier attack command while moving at full speed, but I guess they've changed that. Good sad. Oh, wait, are we? Oh, okay, that's a bit awkward. Um, change target, everybody. <laughs> There's one that's way closer than the other one. Engage! Oh, he's so screwed! I actually feel bad. I, I, I really do feel bad. Wait, no, I don't. They're pirates. Screw those guys. I have no uh, sympathy for criminals. They chose that life. Purge the criminal scum. We must destroy... Oh, God. The uh, I think the, um, the cultists are wearing off of me. <laughs> okay, I think this might be a little bit too far away to actually get there in time. Let's see what happens, I guess. I don't know how, but they did like a wanted curl on those torpedoes. It was pretty impressive. Is my uh, ship attacking ready? He's too slow. <laughs> it's the worst, worst carrier. I need to get one of those... Um, to be fair, I did want to turn it into a really weird combat carrier, but I, I felt like I needed some kind of combat vessel in case I fight like an onslaught or something. I mean, it does work. I feel like an astral, though, with six, like, maybe like, yeah... Four bombing, four trident bombing wings, and also a um, like two guards maybe would be awesome. But I can't get one. I think they cost like a million pounds. So one day. Okay, can we drop this command? Because it's like they're super far away. <laughs> well, it's like he's dying anyway, so I'm not that bothered. Guys, let's attack the nearest target if you can. Um, there's actually a random mule here. Can we get my guys to gank it quickly? Gank squad, go! Yeah, I'm just going to randomly spin around like a ballerina for a few seconds and I'll reorientate myself. Okay, let's have a look. So we've got a strike, got an enforcer. Most of my guys are actually reloaded. Go! I thought they were dead, actually. We've got loads of heavy mullers. I <laughs> mullers? Yes, that's what I want to see. It works! <laughs> the carrier combat unit. It's alive. Okay, I get my guys to split off and grab these nav boys as well. And it looks like that guy's uh, legging it. I don't think we can capture him though. We'll get him on the um, auto resolve at the end if we can. There seems to be a shrike heading towards me. Can you not please? Or I should put my shield up. <laughs> I think my uh, my battleship, I mean carrier, has probably got this handled. Ah, this is what I want to see. It's your time to shine. You just miss. <laughs> At the range of these, um, do you know what I didn't do with this ship? Did I put the... I got to check the build afterwards. I'm pretty sure I put the target increase for the range on there. Surely, I must have. Guess we've got all the com relays now, which is pretty handy. Uh, I'm surprised these last few ships haven't died immediately. They must be uh, doing a pretty good job here. Guys, engage. That's that one gone. Let's go for the Venture. Venture Mark II. I don't know why. When I was a kid, I don't know why. I always thought MK stood for milk. And I kept calling it milk. And everyone was like, what are you talking about? <laughs> we got a Venture Milk II. And then I realized when it was Mark, it made a lot more sense. Um, but that was until way later in my life. <laughs> but we're not going to dwell on that now. It's totally fine. Don't worry about it. Oh, we got loads of stuff. I feel like I'm... I'm oh, oh, don't do that. <laughs> Pirate raid averted. Super victory. Good job, everybody. I need to check this. Did I build in... I did. 60% increase in... Um, distance of shooting. Sorry, my brain just stops working sometimes. It's a big problem. <laughs> it just goes like, I'm tired. <laughs> I'm turning off. Okay, I'm going to keep waiting though. How long we got, guys? Five days to go. Soon. Very soon. They are here. Oh, it's actually rated as a no-no battle. Let's do it. I like no-no battles. For oh, the power of no-no. Let me just make sure I got everything I need first. I think we are good to go, so I'm looking forward to it. Let's take these guys down. Where do you think you're going? 
You thought you can steal my billions of AI cores? You are severely mistaken. Oh, wait, who's this? What is happening? <laughs> Did they help each other? They're in an alliance. Oh, no. Well, this is working out pretty well, then, because I remember this from when I played last time. Alliances send assistant fleets to each other's endeavors. I'm very lucky that I happened across this one before it joined up the other one, or we might have been doomed. Uh, so I will take down the loot past Holy Amada first. Everybody, I did attempt to win this battle here, and it was a disaster. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, I probably could have edged a win, but it's got to the point where there was only like four ships left on either side. And I was like, is this really worth winning this way? Probably not. And I discovered a few things. Um, this guy is cursed. <laughs> I think the AI is kind of like, it thinks it's a carrier, but it wasn't. And it was doing really weird things like reversing into the enemy lines and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, this, this thing needs to be redesigned, uh, that is for sure. <laughs> I'll put some clips in there anyway, people can see what I'm on about. We can gank it, men! Well, maybe we can't. Maybe it's got too much point defense. Okay, I don't know what- this is a weird strategy, my friend. The enemy's above you, and you're showing it your ass. Are you trying to burn it with your engine? Okay, I'm actually kind of concerned by that, uh, but luckily it seems that these point defense drones are actually keeping stuff at bay, so it's not that bad. Anyway, uh, this is actually a ruse, everybody. This entire armada is lying to me. The actual hegemony fleet is already at June as we speak, and it's about to finish taking it, well not taking it over, but disrupting it for uh, two months. If you'll see in a second. There you go, so I got completely bamboozled. I, of course, as I've now been wronged by this faction, I will now dedicate my entire brain function to destroying them and wiping out the galaxy, because I hate people that hurt me. And if they hurt me, I hurt them back ten times. So we're going to be taking them down. <laughs> Scum! Get back here! Now, luckily for me, I did actually manage to get my to calls from the system before they attacked so i only just got disrupted territory so it wasn't that bad um, unfortunately they wouldn't let me attack them i'll just do the auto resolve ah oh, nearly worked yeah they're not getting away though these people are all dying um they've made their choice and they will pay for it no you will pay for what you've done no one messes with me Dead. okay cool um now, before I leave, I probably should also take care of that large pirate convoy. <laughs> Where did it go? Not there. Is that them? That's them. Okay, let's take these guys out as well. Oh, actually, before I attack, can I just double check something? Have I got level ups? I do have level ups. Um, ooh. What one do we need? What do we want? Does... I don't know. Does this affect the efficiency of fighters? Fighter refit time. It's terrible. Never mind. <laughs> I'm not gonna. 3% is pathetic. It can go from free defense. Okay, I'm not gonna worry about that. I was gonna say I can go and get more. Um, beam of up there, but no worries. I'll grab this one though. More range. Definitely a win for us. Uh, let's also grab, I guess, field modulation then. And. Ooh. Ooh. I guess I could go for this one. It does make them slightly better. The rest of the skills aren't as um, present in my opinion. So they grab that one. And I think everyone is happy. Perfect. Cool. So that's done. I keep forgetting about that. So I'll save anyway just to get that in the... Uh, I'll lock that in. And let's take down these engaged bandits. Join battle? Oh, there must be like a random person somewhere. <laughs> Help me! Okay. Also, I was thinking as well, now that I'm going to have to make this into a carrier, what is the point of it? Because it costs the same as Herons, right? And I can get six fighters for 40 points instead of four. So it not just be better to have loads of Herons? <laughs> just going to put it out there. Uh, I mean, like in the inverse, you've got the Astral, for instance, which holds six. And has a really cool ability for fighters, uh, fighters and bombers specifically. So that is more of like a proper ship I think to get. I mean in this ship's defense it is a um, low tech ship. It's like very barbarian-esque. It literally just has a burn drive for some reason. It's it's a bit odd. 
It is a low tier battleship without to say to say the least. What did I just say there? I have no idea. It was like a tongue twister, but I said it by accident. It was a brain twister. Anyway, uh, let's carry on, shall we? I need to murder these pirates. We need to, <laughs> I need to relieve my stress of my Connie being destroyed. Well, not destroyed, but damaged. By killing pirates. Go, everybody. I believe in you. Um. Okay, we're a bit too far away. Let's just focus on these random guys here first. Back to me. I right, survived. There's a lot of point defense there. We might need to uh, try and deal with that. Are you not going to start reversing into the enemy again, are you? We'll see what happens. <laughs> so let's hope he doesn't do it again. Although without the um, excessive amount of very decent destroyers, I think we should be okay in this battle. Okay, attack. I mean, it's, it's, it's support for shooting these gorse cannons is pretty handy, though. I wonder if I can just... Uh, maybe I'll make it into a... I'll keep it anyway, because I already own it, right? I'll make it into, like, a missile bomber dude. Ooh. Maybe, like, a Kopesh bomb thing. I don't know. I don't know. We think about it. We'll see what's available when we get back to a um, starport, and I'll see what I want to do with it. I mean, it has definitely has the ordinance points to have, like, multiple trident wings, though. Excellent. Enemy down. Oh, that guy's only dead already. I guess they must have set through the shields with the attacks there. Oh, it's definitely dead. Cool. So I guess we've already killed most of them, right? Oh, wow, there's a lot of guys going to defend that point over there. Uh, can someone go and grab the nav boy? Oh, that was the wrong button. Someone go and grab the nav boy. Maybe not someone that's really far away. Are you okay? A bit concerned about your HP, sir. Maybe you just, uh, retreat. Didn't do enough damage there, but it's okay. Hmm. I need to get more, some more units. Let's go and regroup command. We've got a lot of bombers. Oh, it's working pretty well now, though. <laughs> it can kill a condor. Perfect. That's a lot of bombs. I reckon... Oh, wow, the point defense was amazing. I guess that is the plus about having all these weird uh, fighter drones. They are pretty good at point defense. Still do my fighters. Okay, interesting. I guess got to wait a little bit longer. Although if I attack now, it'll just die. Go for it. Believe, men. Is that gonna? Oh, I split in half. Cool. Dead as well. Very cool. Um, we got a few left, and then we have done this battle, which is awesome. They actually had quite a lot of fighters. That's probably the most amount of fighters I've had to fight this entire series. But luckily for me, they're only equipped to the really low level ones. I guess maybe tri Taco would probably be the hardest faction to fight, fighter to fighter, because they probably have the Astral in their large fleets, which would be a bit annoying and very powerful. They're only a mule and enforcer left. Okay, so hopefully get it. I kind of wish my speed boost would work. <laughs> I've got to double check that skill again. I've got to remember to look at it. Uh, let's go for that guy. Let's get him out of the way. Then it's just a bunch of shepherds left. And we won. I think I definitely have enough money to actually redo a lot of... Uh, do redo this ship. Though. I have like, I think half a million still. So we are doing pretty well there. And I might also be able to pick up another trade mission for a ton of money as well while I'm over there. Finish him! It's always the shepherds alive at the end. <laughs> I said it the other day and I'll say it again. For some reason, the shepherds are very, very uh, good at surviving. Wait, okay. Lily, done. Good job, everybody. Okay, that is another pirate armada dealt with. Look at all this stuff we've picked up. Pardon shields. Ah, oh, so much cool stuff. Okay. He's ready to level up. Okay, if you're going to be commanding the big ship, you need to get... 
this one. Yes. Next school elites. So now he would actually vent stuff while having the shield online. Um, yeah, I'm okay. I'm happy with that. So how are we doing now with my um, threat level? Minimal. Cool. This won't last very long, but still. I guess if I look at this, this will come online. It hopefully will start making it a little bit easier to keep up with the uh, amount of enemies doing things around the area. Okay. Um, I guess we need to head back. Let me just double check. They didn't nick my things, did they? No, weirdly, they did not nick all my AI core. I was remembering. Oh, I, I took it from the inventory. I forgot I had loads in the actual building. They just didn't care. <laughs> they just left it alone. Oh, uh, yeah, without this, though, this place is pretty cursed. Um, I guess I'll keep paying for it to get the crow freight up. But, yeah, it's got no money for at least a month now. So, oh, great. Excuse me, are you trying to kill my prospector? How are they prospecting with only a fuel carrier? Oh no, there's another one. That's them! Wait, are they still hostile? They're still hostile! Oh my god. Okay, I'm just gonna leave. I don't think they attack me, right? Because they've already... They're, they're, the thing's done, right? They've already wrecked me. I'm gonna leave and hope it's okay. <laughs> let's just hope it doesn't cause a problem. Okay, let's go back to the freeport. Ooh, loads of missions. Um, okay, Freeport. I need to for you to give me tons of new weapons. And maybe some missile launchers. Wait, wait, let's go, let's go look what we can try and change over. Tell me your secrets, prison port. Can I just get tree missions whenever I want now then? I can sell ships. How much do they sell for? Not, not really worth it. What is this? Damn! Oh! Interesting. Probably not as worth it as a regular trade mission, to be honest. If I look at luxury goods... Base is 79 credits per unit. That's a bit... Is that... That must be dynamics. That seems like a really weird thing to put it as. Um, so I could make a big profit there, technically. Screw it, we'll do it, we'll do it. What I'll do, I can set the mission, get it from my colony back at June, because it actually makes them, and then I'm going to sell them for a profit. Everyone's happy. Anyway, um, let's see. While I'm here. This ship needs to be changed. Needs to be made anew. So I've already got some salamanders there. These are all actually composites. So I can actually put missiles here if I want to. Aha! I will switch that over. Finisher. I'm not keen about the finishing thing, to be honest. Um, we're getting a lot closer there. I think we've got enough point defense already. And I can't really change these that much. I guess the main thing's going to be... Oh, there's no tridents here. No. I guess fine. We'll just put three dagger bombers. And we will have, I guess, a broadsword as well. But it's a shame I haven't got any of the anti-shield guys. But this should now be a lot better at just helping out anyway. So I will definitely put all that on there. We haven't got any fighter things, have we? No. Not that I can see anyway. How bad is this ship affected by its demods? I think I was a bit harsh on it. I mean, it's not going to be helping, but it doesn't seem to be too crazy there. Okay, so done that. I guess I need to grab the actual... Not that one. Where is it? This fella. Um, I'll be happy to smack it out, actually. Get rid of the rail guns. They do cost quite a bit of flux to fire. I wanted to be around the same level so it can like continually fight. Um, I guess as for this, I can put down more point defense. I'm kind of technically degrading these, but it, it's okay. Don't worry about it. I guess that's okay. We'll leave that for now. Oh, I might also want to consider, if I'm making it a bit more of a missile carrier, I might also want to consider something to do with missiles. Let's have a look. 
So we can do the ECCM package. Um, missiles top speed up 25% and movability up 50%. Also reduces the weapon range of reduction. Interesting. Tempting. It is tempting. But at the same time, these missiles aren't great. So I think it's okay as it is. We've got a lot of stuff going for it now. Hopefully this will be a bit better in combat. Um, everyone else I'm actually happy with. I think everyone else did quite a good job. Uh, though I am weird that the AI of the Tempest seems a lot more um, susceptible to instant death than it used to be. Oh, let's put it that way. I guess... Oh, I want salamanders. <laughs> oh, there's... Wait, I'm wrong. There is salamanders. Okay. Salamander. It'd be a nice little dueling weapon for these guys to have, I think. Push them all over. I think I actually have enough for all of them, which is super handy. Oh, that one. That one. Oops. Done. Okay. I'm happy with that. So before I actually headed out to do some other ship scanning, I actually spent a lot of money and I need to do some quick missions to not go bankrupt next month. So I actually am doing a really quick transfer trade thing. And also I'm helping kill some pirate guys in a system with double bounties. So hopefully we can get enough money from this to not go bankrupt next month. <laughs> uh, let's have a look. So there's quite a few of them. I think with my bombers and stuff, we should be able to get the majority of the kills here if we just get a little bit closer. Um, go! I believe in you guys. Yes, I've actually now uh, started making the heavy industry at my little, what was it called, the space station one? Uh, Thanos, I think it was called. Thanos's view. Something like that, I can't remember. But yes, yeah, so hopefully uh, eventually in half a year, that would actually get to the point where they start making combat ships so we get a little bit more protection from various things. Uh, ooh, let's go for the pirate cruiser, shall we? If you're nearby, guys, fire the missiles. Oh, that didn't really work out very well. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, ooh. Let's go for the guys that are blocking my fighter bombers first, and I'll go for the mule in front of me. Keep firing! Very nice. I kind of feel like I would do... I kind of want, like, more bombers in my my, my particular wing. <laughs> I might try and get, like, uh, even more. Maybe get, like, a second bombing wing of um, daggers. Okay, looks like things are looking pretty good at the moment. I think I'm getting a lot of kills myself with my fleet here, so we should get hopefully quite a lot of money. Oh, here comes all the big ships. You guys know what to do. Take them down. There is a lot of allies helping us as well, if you can't sell, so it's a bit, bit of a congested battlefield, to say the least. I might try and get some Kopesh bombers, actually. I wonder if that might be a good alternative to the um, longbows. As cool as longbows are, sometimes the uh, anti-shield attack gets there behind. Well, um, after the torpedo, so it's not perfect. What's, what's this ship? It's a oh, it's like a non-broken version. I don't think I've ever actually seen the non... <laughs> I've never actually seen the proper version of it before. What is happening with this giant conga line of drones? Very good. That's their flagship over there, so I probably should try and get a kill on that if I can. I want to see more torpedoes, guys. Fire the torpedoes! I haven't bothered deploying the capital ship, I don't think. No, I haven't, no. Well, I can anyway, there's too many guys in the battlefield. Ah, here we go. That might be enough to kill it, because it is a very lightly armoured cruiser. We've got the very annoying free ship to kill. Oh, I didn't realise I was being shot there. Oops. Eventually, its luck will run out. Just keep firing stuff at it. And dead. Excellent. I think that should be it. Okay, let's hope for a lot of money. Let's hope for a lot of money. Come on, game. I got supplies back at least, so that's a bit of a win. Oh, I'll take it. I'll take it. As she disappears, I've got to drop this, some supplies here. I was just trying to see if I could find some better income stuff, but it didn't really work out too well, to be honest. Give me my, like, what was it, like, 20 grand or something? <laughs> it's, pretty, it's pretty bad. Yeah, 18k. Importance very high. He's a badass. We probably should develop that one, I guess. 
Yeah, so this good guy is going to give us amazing missions, so we definitely prioritize them. Okay, um, let's see. What do these guys sell anyway? Ah, the conquests. I love the conquests. Yet, alas, we cannot delve into their beauty this this series, everybody. Okay. This guy's doing bounties. Nah. Nah. Okay, so I think I've got enough money to not go bankrupt this time. Um, I guess we'll see in a second. Last month was um, interesting to say the least. <laughs> it's fine. Don't worry about it. I guess uh, so. Since, since last month, we'll see in a second anyway. June is now working again. June is back making the old monies again, which is pretty handy. I did have to turn off the old um, hazard pay though. I just couldn't afford it at the moment. So I thought I'd just leave it off for now. If I turn off report, is that? No, it's causes multiple, multiple issues. We'll leave it off for now. Okay. Oh, also, I was going to check. Now I got the... Where is it? Where would it be, game? Where would it be? This one. Negative five monthly factor from Patrol HQ. So pretty cool. Um, so we pretty much offset the ludic path, so it won't be as violent going up to getting a lot of issues. Okay, apart from that, let's head over to our objective, shall we? I think 93k would be enough um, to keep us going for a little bit. Or is there any more pirates? Let's go and check the other warp point because there's like a big army of them. And then we'll move on to the exploration. Hello? Ah. There seems to be quite a few. Okay. We'll take these guys down. Should we try out my brand new fully functioning battle carrier? Unfortunately, without tridents. <laughs> Damn it. That's a lot of bombers, though. That is a lot of bombers. Also, kind of interesting how it's doing with the old uh, missile spam as well. Because the range of these missiles is 4k, so it can pretty much just fire them as soon as it gets near a combat. Oh, I'm pretty well. Um, <laughs> I like how these guys are pretty much missile guys, even though they're just using drones. I mean, it works. They're killing everything, so it does work. There's still a lot of basic guys. Where are the main enemies? Tell me where they are. There they are. Okay, I want to go for that guy. Engage! Okay, did I make a lot of impact there? No. But did I break its shield? Yes. <laughs> I'll take that as a win. I want to see a, a triple squad bombing run. We'll see them eventually, I guess. Yeah, let's back up a little bit though. I'm getting a bit close. I guess I want to probably kill this guy before he murders me. Let me just send my guys in. Well, he's definitely not going to be in. Oh, there, it's coming! It's happening! Yeah, I don't think many ships are going to probably survive that, to be honest. That's a lot of bombers. So got the Gorth Cans on there, though, so I think that would be a pretty good uh, balance, because it can do long-range tactical support, as well as all these really slow pillum launcher missiles. Nope, don't you dare try and kill me with your really slow missiles, sir. I saw them coming. How did that even happen? <laughs> I guess the flares might have uh, thrown him off there. Bit annoying. Let's try again, shall we? I like how if I keep on regroup mode, they just fire missiles if they're really close. I mean, not. Maybe that was a coincidence. We still got that guy miles away. He's still being spammed by a bunch of torpedoes. Oh, it's doomed. It's doomed. Yes! No, what? <laughs> they just bounced off it! Oh, I can't believe it. It's okay. We can try again. This time, I will help. It is going... I think it's because it's speed. It kind of like... They launched it maybe a little bit too early. Okay, what that time? Uh, if my, my brothel's nearby, can you finish off that guy? Get him! <laughs> He's like, oh god! 
This is where I kind of, I don't know if like Brawl Swords are technically better. I think the Brawl Swords are really good at killing shields. But at the same time, I think the Gladius' speed made up better at killing frigates, in my opinion. Um, can we not catch this guy? Somebody stop this man! Okay, come back. I'll do speed boost instead. There's still loads of actual enemy ships everywhere, which is interesting. We haven't lost anybody though, so everyone's doing okay. Oh, it's been flanked! Oh, surely a Tempest can get it. Good job. Oh, are you okay there, buddy? I am moving forward as fast as I can, but we are still quite far away. So we've got all the enemy carriers to kill now. You guys need to you need to retreat, friend. You're really hurt. They've definitely done something to the Tempest AI. It doesn't seem as um, steady as it was before. But I guess it was a very powerful ship earlier. Oh, wait, it might have been attacked by this fighter spam. That could have been what the problem was. Okay, start bombing runs. Go, go! Oh, no, the torpedoes! <laughs> oh, that's, that's great. I love it. I should have found a... Maybe I should have done a mod, though, with, like, more awesome bombing runs. I have some really cool ones in the uh, ones I did before. Get that little frigate. That's most of them then. I hopefully, I, I think I might get more money from this battle than the last one. Because there's two big fleets. And there might be another one further along as well. I might be able to grab before I leave. I mean, while there's a double bounty, why not take advantage of it? There's a, this guy left. Yes. And this guy is... Oh, there's two left, technically. And then we're done here. Oh. That might kill it. I was thinking as well, with my, um... Carry here, it hasn't got the 50% damage increase as well. So I still think probably Heron's would be better. So I was just thinking about it, I was like, hmm, wait a second. This is, like, my bombing run is equivalent of slightly more, like, 50% more damage. It's actually way better having Herons than this guy, anyway. I, I'll, I'll, I'll keep it for now, but at least until I get more other ships, we'll just uh, keep up in the air. Let's just do a quick auto-resolve. Loads more supplies. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Beautiful. I even got a pirate vendetta against me. They, they are so annoyed with me. <laughs> Okay, was that it for the fleets? This might actually have been... Oh, there's a lot of stuff down this way, apparently. Hello? If I get them both together, it'll probably be enough. No, 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 guys. You don't understand. Fight me together. Combine your forces. Okay, never mind. <laughs> uh, I think we will do this one I Hey, that's quick. Uh, let's get that out of the way. Ah, oh, this is great. I love this. <laughs> Tons of money. Where the, wait, where'd the other one go? I'm going to take advantage of this system while I can. Look at the money we're making. It is beautiful. No, no. Where's the lot? Oh, there's a double pirate group. you got to see the station action, right? Let's just uh, witness its glory. I'll just let this them kill the station and then we attack our... Oh, no, it's a proper station. <laughs> that's not a small... Oh, wait, no, that's a level 2 one, isn't it? I don't think it's deploying space mines. So I'm not seeing any. No, I don't think it's deploying space mines. Space mines are like the most OP, OP thing ever, so... <laughs> they kill everything. Let's take this going down first, shall we? I think this uh, station is probably going to get the majority of the damage, unfortunately. So we have to try and bypass and get as many kills as possible. I don't want to get too close because I might get myself overwhelmed here. Okay, switch to them all. My other allies are a bit far away. Actually, most of them went that way. Yeah, go in front of the station and kill as many as possible, guys. Very cautious about this guy here. He might 
turn around and just burn into me. I'll wait for my guys to repair and I'll start taking them down. Yeah, go for it. Tempest destroyed? It's not as reliable as it used to be, guys. If anything, I think I need to. I think what I'm missing is probably the cautious behavior. I used to use in the. I used to have a mod that used to assign behaviors. So I think I definitely need that next time I play the game. I'll grab that again next time. Oh, they're all just getting red now. There's so many of them left. All of a sudden, just like seven guys die in like two seconds. Pretty impressive. That was a crazy boring run. Impressive. a really busted part is that is it turned off or something what's it doing i'm just spinning spinning in space we might be able to get it with a lot of dps if we yes to go with it fire come on tempest finish it off buddy excellent oh this one's going down as well Oh no! My eyes! We definitely have this one as well. Take it down, buddy. Dead and... Dead? It will die in a second when those torpedoes hit. No! <laughs> Damn you! He's actually nearly escaping, so I'm going to send my ghost to attack as well. We can't let the giant Colossus freighter escape. Okay, thank you. Some of them did actually escape. Can't believe it. Okay, not, not perfect, but it's okay. I'll recover my little friend there. Probably broke even again with the supplies I'm going to gather. And we got tons of money again. Beautiful. I should probably probably even afford if I wanted to a... Oh, actually. Let's do plan B, shall we? Let's do plan B. I found a way of cheating, by the way. Um, if I go to operatives. And I move them. To the free ports. I've got to remember to turn this off. Okay. Ash and Sight. Procure ships. I can see what they got for sale. <laughs> it's pretty handy. I wouldn't actually use it to buy anything because there's a finder fee. So I'd rather not. But still, it's pretty handy. It is pretty cool. Yeah, because you got to wipe tariffs. Screw that. Screw that. Although it's not that much far away, to be honest. But it's fine. So I just wanted to use that just to see where on earth I might be able to find a proper carrier. Actually, I... Give me a second, guys. I'll see if there's any available anywhere on the map. Okay, I made my agent fly everywhere. I cannot see more, unfortunately. I will just dump her in the prison free port, though, for the future. Uh, go there. Thank you very much. Okay, uh, I definitely like I kind of run out of time a little bit. It's been a bit, a bit of a chaotic episode for me, because I've been splitting up a lot with, uh, like, various reloads and stuff. Um, I can actually get more industries if I wanted to. What do I need, though? I haven't got mining. But I don't think this is a good place to mine. I do have vast ruins. Let's, let's grab vast ruins, shall we? Let's go for tech mining. I don't normally do tech mining, but while it's vast and untapped, we will build it and maybe delete it later on. I'll keep the rest of it as a bit of a um, buffer. And I guess we'll head off and do some exploring next episode, then. I bet everyone has enjoyed. As always, please like, subscribe, and comment below. And I'll see you next time. Bye.